Worksheet 5. Properties of Saturated and Unsaturated Solutions General instruction, watch and understand this video. For laptop users, you may copy and answers and use the Google documents provided by your teachers or teacher. And then for smartphone, tablet, or iPad users, please copy and answer in your notebook. Then take picture and attach to your Google Classroom. Activity number one, prepare the materials Do this simple activity. Okay, you need to identify class the solutions if they are saturated or unsaturated. Give reason or your answers. Okay, materials needed. Class, kailangan nyo mag-prepare ng dalawang cup. Okay, dalawang cup. Okay, any cup, pwede yung transparable, tra sorry, trans transparent na, na glass. Pwede yung transparent na lalagyan, basta dalawang um, lalagyan. Kung walang cup, di maghanap na lang po ng dalawang uri ng lalagyan. And then, mag-prepare din kayo class ng sugar. Okay? Mag-prepare kayo ng sugar kasi gagamitin nyo yan mamaya. Aside from that class, uh, mag-prepare din kayo ng teaspoon for stirring. Kung walang, kung walang kutsara, pwedeng gamitan nyo ng stick or anything na pwede nyo panghalo. Okay? Note class, note. Cup of water should be the same and equal amounts for both solutions. Take note, pag naglagay kayo ng tubig glass sa dalawang cup, kailangan equal ang amount ng tubig. Okay? Equal ang amount. Okay? O pareho ang amount. Okay, let's move now to the procedures. Okay? In procedure number one class, Label the two cups with solution A and solution B appropriately. Ibig sabihin class, mag, o oh, ilabel nyo class yung dalawang cup na ipinirepair nyo, lagyan nyo ng solution A and solution B. Step 2. Dissolve 1 teaspoon of sugar in 1 cup of water for solution A. Okay? Dissolve. Ibig sabihin, tunawin yung isang teaspoon of sugar sa iyong 1 cup of water for solution A. Step 3. Stir until all sugar are dissolved. So, kailangan mong haluin yung sugar and water na nasa solution A na bottle hanggat ito ay mamix o madissolve. Step 4. Dissolve another 1 teaspoon of sugar in a 1 cup of water for solution B. Ngayon, solution B na tiklas ha? And then, stir until all sugar are dissolved. Okay? Kung anong ginawa nyo class sa uh, baso o cup dun sa solution A, ganun din ang gagawin nyo dito class sa solution B. Paghalo inyo class. Okay? Stir hanggat ito ay madissolve. Ngayon, in number 6 class, ito kailangan nyo tatandaan. You need to add another 1 teaspoon of sugar in the same cup of water for solution B. Okay? Ibig sabihin, dadagdagan nyo class ng isang teaspoon of sugar ang inyong solution B o yung cup na may nakalabel na solution B. And then, stir until all sugar are dissolved. Okay? Copy and complete the chart below. Okay, ito yung gagawin nyo class. Column 1, types of solution. Solution A, solution B. Ito yung sa cup A, ito yung cup B. And then, saturated and unsaturated. And then, observe observations that will support your answer. For example, class, solution A. Ano bang solution A? Saturated or unsaturated? Yung B, saturated or unsaturated? Then after that class, you need to explain or observe. Okay, write all your answers here. Okay? Thank you. And then next. Okay. Activity number two. 
based on your observation, you need to determine if the given solution are either saturated or unsaturated. Okay? Ito lang, ito ilalagay nyo class ha? either saturated or unsaturated. Number one, if 500 grams of flour completely dissolved in a lit in one liter of water. Okay? Number two, when another 200 grams of flour was added in the solution, the additional flour was not dissolved completely and settled. Is it saturated or unsaturated? Number three, the solutions cannot hold any more solute when added in the solution. Is it saturated or unsaturated? Number four, one pack of gelatin powder completely dissolved in 400 grams of water. Saturated or unsaturated? Number five, the milk powder cannot be dissolved anymore in a cup of water. Is it saturated or unsaturated? Okay. In activity number three class, you need to write a short paragraph regarding the differences between saturated and unsaturated solutions. Okay? Type of solution, we have saturated solution and unsaturated solution. You need to explain class about the difference between the two solutions here. Okay? Gumawa kayo ng cell na ganito or isulat nyo sa inyong notebook and then you need to write all your answers here. Diyan, isulat nyo kung ano ang pinagkaiba ng dalawang solution na to.